we use our audience, if you like, to help build our brand in the sense that we are all about helping people engage, understand, and participate in current events. So there, there should be no surprise as to what's going on in the world and why it's happening. Uh, we also make it very easy for people then to, um, as, as Ariana was mentioning this morning, to empathize so that uh, they, they can go and, and volunteer, they can go and contribute. Uh, again, there's a variety of different tools. The technology here is really key because uh, until a few years ago, you could not do this. Uh, news was a very uh, passive uh, event. You watched the evening news or you read your newspaper and there was really very few ways for you to participate. Now with the technology that's available and with the social tools uh, that are available, uh, it's, it's very easy for you to, um, to participate. When it comes to citizen journalism or, help, or having people make a contribution, um, it, it really calls to the fact that, uh, that journalism is changing uh, dramatically. Journalism used to be you know, one expert or one experienced person who uh, was the journalist and he was the gatekeeper and that person uh, checked the facts and, and, and then decided when the news was good and ready uh, to be released. Today, news uh, is, is everywhere, and you can't put that genie back in the bottle. And uh, the, the, you know, the news is free, news is out, and people, people are helping tell the story. Um, a very good example might be Haiti. Um, as you know, uh, the, the, the whole country was, particularly Port-au-Prince, was devastated. There, there was no more infrastructure. However, we did, we and other news outlets, found a lot of people who had cell phones, uh, when internet access became available again, satellite phones, and they were contributing uh, pictures and eyewitness stories and videos. And the story of Haiti was told in, in a way that if you, had, if you were just relying on either the existing media that, whose infrastructure was destroyed or sending a foreign correspondent, you would never have had that story in a, such a poignant fashion.